doctor, someone who studies a lot of life. Somewhere in that writing, you are going to find the language of astonishment. Everyone in these 21,000 species has different color pattern, every one of them has different shaped wings, their diversity is just so magnificent. As you watch a butterfly, to describe what you're looking at, you can't really put it into words. That's biology, that's also magic. It is impossible to look at a caterpillar turning into a butterfly and not ask. How did their metamorphosis, their life cycle, and how did this happen? This is astonishing, remarkable transformation. In a metamorphic insect, what you got is two body plans. First, you have to form one functional body plan and then you have to switch gears. You have to take and form a new body plan. I am amazed by the development in which it goes from egg to caterpillar. It is such an interesting process, but then you have to enter the prison stage and you have to get it right. You've got to rid of or digest the caterpillar tissues. They won't work for the adults. In fact, the cells themselves to disappear but then their components are recycled and are turned into a kind of soap of, out of which the adult structures be built. It is very carefully engineered. You gotta know where you're gonna end up before you start. Looks like a different organism. Transitions have take place in the heart, antenna, and reproductive organs. They have to recreate adult legs, adult antennae, adult eyes, they have to change the shape of the brain and the connections between the antennae and the eyes. They have to reformat the gut so that it switches from eating plant material to eating nectar. You begin to see the depth of the problem. So for evolution to have created this sort of pathway, gradually it would take a miracle. When you see certain effects of nature, it is your responsibility as investigator to find the cause. That would explain the effect if you saw a mechanical device of the sophistication of the butterflies. You would not for a moment hesitate to describe that to intelligence. Because the butterfly is so much more sophisticated, almost beyond our comprehension. Anything that we make, planning, foresight, artistry, engineering. When we process all the evidences revealed in the metamorphosis and then ask yourself on your own experience what kind of cause could bring about this kind of result? I think the only reasonable answer is an intelligence that transcends this natural world. <laughs>